Well, just a few moments ago, we heard from an elderly Israeli woman released overnight from captivity in Gaza by Hamas. That's 16 days after having been abducted from her home in a kibbutz in southern Israel, close to the border with Gaza. Yochaved Lifshitz says that a doctor attended to her during her time in captivity. She said the hostages that she was with were given medicine. And she, was, she said that after her capture, once inside Gaza, she was taken into a network of tunnels underneath the Gaza Strip. She described them as looking like a spider web. Her daughter helped her translate her account. My mom is telling the horrific stories. She's saying that many, many people, a swarm of people, came through the fence. The defense cost two and a half billion shekels, and it didn't help even a little bit. My mom is saying that she was taken on the back of a motorbike with her body, uh, with her legs on one side and her head on another side. That she was taken through the plowed fields with a man in front on one side and a man behind her, and that while she was do being taken, she was hit by uh, sticks by Shabab. Shabab. Yeah, Shabab pe people. Until they reach the tunnels. There, there they walked for a few kilometers on the wet ground. There are a huge, um, huge uh, network of tunnels underneath. It looks like a spider web. Yochaved Lifchitz also spoke about how the hostages that she was with in Gaza were treated. My mom is talking about coming there. When they arrived, they arrived into a large hall. Uh, 5 of them she among Can them I, yeah. were taken into a separate room my mom is saying that they they were very friendly towards them and that they took care of them that they were given the medicine okay <laughs> uh, that they were given they were given medicine and they were uh, treated one of the men with them um, had a badly injured from, for, uh, from a motorbike accident on the way and the paramedic was looking after his wounds. He was given uh, um, medicine and antibiotics, uh, that the people were friendly, that they kept the place very clean, they were very concerned about sure. them. That was uh, Sharon Lipschitz translating for her mum, Yochaved, one of two elderly Israeli hostages released overnight from Gaza. Um, Yochaved's husband, so Sharon's father, remains inside Gaza, one of the 220 hostages still in the Gaza Strip.